Hey, welcome back to the channel. This channel is dedicated to the best mobile video solution that's out there, which was KineMaster for the longest time, and I have switched and transitioned to LumaFusion. This video is gonna be a discussion of what I feel the pros and cons of using LumaFusion versus KineMaster are. For myself, it's the professional video editing solution that I was looking for when I started this journey. I'm going to start doing tutorials about it, but right now I'm just gonna discuss why you may or may not want to use this application versus this one. To be fair for KineMaster, I'm gonna give you the top reasons to stay with KineMaster, and there definitely are some. First of all is that the content library of stickers, of fun transitions, of get projects, there is not this content in LumaFusion. So if what you're into is doing content that has these fun stickers or these fun transitions or things like this, then KineMaster is the one to stick with. Secondly, it is a simpler interface. It's a simpler program. It's not as professional, but it is easier to use. So those are two really strong things that you may want to stick with KineMaster for. Now all the awesome things about LumaFusion. Number one, copy and paste everything, video, audio, clips. You move them, copy them to the place where you want them. Even cooler, all the properties or parameters, colors, effect settings can be copied onto any one or many of other objects in there. Two, animate anything and everything. This means that if you want a color change to go from light to dark and then back to dark again, if you want blurriness to go from more blurry to less blurry and any of the above, any property, any motion, any opacity, this was one of my favorites, is to have opacity come in and out at different points. All can be animated with keyframes. Anything and everything. Awesome. Three, transitions in layers, not just clips. I make movies out of layers all the time, and so often I wanted to have a transition between two items in a layer. LumaFusion has this feature, but a transition between two of anything. Awesome again. Number four, super cool multi-select. You have a stack of things you wanna keep in line. Turn on multi-select, one, two, three. Move them as a group. Yes, thank you, LumaFusion. Number five is all about color. First of all is that LUTs can be imported, which are color profiles that are out there on the internet and are professionally used by filmmakers. Second, there is more extensive and deeper color profiling and color is super important. Awesome. I'm gonna stop numbering. The text tool is the next amazing, super robust, so many features. It's like a pro text tool, as good as in the Adobe products. Another killer feature is you can see the sound waveform in the clips much better uh, in LumaFusion, and you can use that for where you cut and splice. Super pro feature, to insert content into your project, you press preview, you slide these sliders, to the point that you want your content to start and to end, and then you hit insert. So if you have a clip that's a minute long, but you only want five seconds of it, you do it in this preview. It makes editing so much easier. Awesome. And believe it or not, everything I've showed you so far is just scratching the surface. There's gonna be more coming, but for the moment, I put on a black shirt to tell you the things that I don't love about it because I don't want you spending your money on it and have one of these things that I tell you be like, why did I waste my money on that? So here we go. The thing I like least is that the interface on my phone is kind of glitchy at times when I touch things, they don't move as smoothly as KineMasters does. I think it's worth it, but it can be frustrating. And really the user interface isn't as good. Your media library is always on screen, takes up space that I wish that you could use for your preview. I hope they change that at some point in time. And the fact is it's harder to use, not because it's more complicated, but it's harder to use and probably always will be for you. There's gonna be a learning curve, but then it's still gonna be a slower process making videos. Those things said, there's far more good than bad. I'm super excited about LumaFusion as a platform and will be making this channel a LumaFusion channel. All videos you see on my channel are shot and produced on my Samsung S20 phone. This one and all future moving are going to be edited 100% in LumaFusion. If you like this and wanna learn more about LumaFusion, like and subscribe, follow me. If you have any questions, put them in the comments. I always get back to people. I always tell people, get out there and make some amazing content with the video platform of your choice. If you wanna make simpler, quicker, faster, more fun videos, KineMaster is a great application and I have lots of content that'll show you how to use it. Otherwise, join me on this new journey making even more cool videos. See you the next time.